Hello guys, welcome back to another studio vlog. I'm sorry, I'm not really sorry. <laughs> Hello guys, welcome back to another studio vlog. Today I have some orders to pack and then I have some new stock in for the website which I will show you and I need to do some photography and add listings to the website. Uh, so I will show you how I do that. So guys, uh, I've been a busy bee and we have got some new products coming to the website uh, but first I have to photograph them all and create all the listings. So exciting. <laughs> Can you tell I'm not that enthusiastic about doing that? Um, you will see why in a minute. Look at all this. I have got all of these different washi tapes to put in the star. All these! And these are all individual different ones. So I have to create listings for all of those. So there's like really cute floral ones with gold on. I love the gold one. Oh, I really like this one. This is like autumnal leaves. Might be a bit late to put this on, but I feel like I'm going to nick some of these for me as well. There's like um, monstera leaves, plain colour washies and grid washies and then these I absolutely love and um, they're a little weird because it's not like it's a washi tape but it has like a film on kind of like a sticker film and these have all got a really nice I love this one it's like got gold bits of gold foil on and little flowers um, some of them, these ones got rabbits on, hummingbirds, and they've all got gold foil on. I think these are just like geometric. And then there's these, which has got like little stars and like celestial patterns. Oh, I love this one. I'm going to nick one of those as well. <laughs> I don't know if any of you ever used a Canon G7X, um, but it has this function where if you want to focus on something in particular, you can tap the screen to focus on it. And it wasn't focusing on the washi. So I've got the camera in one hand, the washi in the other hand, and I'm using my nose on the screen <laughs> trying to tap the washi so that it focuses on the washi that I'm holding. Um, so that's fun. Does anyone else use those filming techniques? Okay guys, so I have finished packing today's orders. I had another four orders to send out today. Uh, Andy is just popping to the post office with those. And I 
I'm about to take some photos of some washi tapes and start adding some listings to the website. Uh, I definitely am not going to get through them all today, but I can make a start. Well, the packaging arrived and it's too big to fit in the packaging station. So I've had to improvise a little bit and I will show you. So normally I would put it in here. So I've got some more of this size, which fits fine. Um, the new size that I've ordered for the new Acrylograph pens is slightly too big. So it's had to go down here. Um, and then I had some stuff already here. So I have to now find somewhere to put that. bought from the same company that I get my packaging these cardboard thingies that's what they call thingies um I don't know what they're called and what these are these they fold into these cardboard bins um, so I'm going to use these on my shelves for storage this is not a flattering angle but it's the best I can do okay guys this is what they look like uh, they kind of hang off a little bit. I thought I could fit four on here. Um, but they kind of... They hang off the edge a little bit. I don't know if I'm best just sticking to three of them or not. Hmm. And he's just made us some tea. A nice stir fry. Uh, here's the reality of being a small business owner, guys. You eat your tea at your desk while you're working. Okay, guys, so I got a little bit distracted by the storage situation and I didn't end up doing any photography, but I will definitely be doing some tomorrow and I will film that for the vlog. Uh, so I really hope you enjoyed the video, guys. If you did, as always, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I will see you next time.